This video is proudly sponsored by Boss Services. These are my partners in all reliable Call of Duty services from level 1000 to camos and much, much more. For a cheap and legit price, go check them out. Link's going to be in the description below. Thanks for the sponsor, bosses. What's crack a lack in YouTube? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. You know what it is. It's your favorite gamer here. I'm the Puff Man, and I'm coming back to you with some more Cold War zombie glitches. Guys, in this one, we got an epic solo unlimited camo XP pileup and mower deer toting. Yeah, yeah, baby. And if any time you guys enjoy this video, you know what to do. Smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, you're going to want to subscribe. So hit that subscribe button with the bell notifications. With all that being said, let's get into this glitch. Come on, baby. Let's go. All right, me amigos, getting right into it here, guys. As soon as you start the game, what you're going to want to do is take these two zip lines. Now, you guys remember that green box from uh, the last, like, getting out of the map uh, glitch? Well, make sure this green box is here. So don't waste your time. Go check, see if it's there. If it's not there, guys, restart your game until it's there because you're going to need that to be there. And you're also going to need these melee weapons, the Psy. So if you don't have the Psy, you could either go and unlock them or you could purchase them from the store. Next thing that I would do, guys, I would go ahead and either hit the box or get a wall weapon. You could change the blueprints on them if you would like. Whatever one you're working on currently for camos, go ahead and grab that. And then simply make your way to pack a punch, guys. You know this simple stuff. Pack a punch, shatter blast. You're definitely gonna want to sh have shatter blast on, guys. It's super OP. I uh, love it. And then for perks, guys, we're gonna be grabbing a jug and stamina up. Now, stamina up, of course, for the fall damage, because if we do fall, we don't want to down ourselves. And jug just for the normal health cap. You know what I mean? We go from 150 to 250. We love it. Yeah, yeah. Now we're coming right here. And we're going to sprint to a jump, spam that mantle button, guys. You should mantle on top. Now, you're going to back up a little bit so we could get a kind of like a running start to jump on top of this zip line. Now, make your way to your left and then a little bit forward here. We're going to kill off the last zombie because now we're good to go. Uh, I do, I do want to go through it here in slow-mo for you guys. So, here we go. Now, right at like where the zip line starts right here is like, see the yellow of the zip line? That's where you're going to want to kind of like hit your jump button. Now, once you've jumped, you're going to want to start spamming that mantle and it should mantle you up top like so. Now, back up, guys. Don't back up too far because you will fall off just enough so we can get a sprint and then jump so we could jump on top of the zip line. And then again, we're going to the left here. And then once we get to like the end of the zip line right here, we're going to turn and we're going to go straight ahead. And then we're just going to be mantling over this sign. And that's it, guys. We're pretty well in the glitch from here. So just a nice little mantle over here, pushing mantle. And then we're standing on top. Now we're going to come to the like to the O of the uh, of the Colbert rooftop here. And then we're just backing up nice and slow till we fall off, guys. And just like that. Bada bing, bada boom. We are in this epic pileup glitch. Now, what I like to do here, guys, is with Shatter Blast, you just wait till all your zombies are piled up here in front of us. And then we're just going to peek up, shoot, and then crouch back down again, guys. That's going to be the best. I mean, it, you'll see it in the gameplay here. The only thing that does get you here are these disciples. So just like... Um, Make sure you guys are ready for them. You know what I mean? Like you guys will see them coming or whatnot and just be ready for them. Ring of fire, maybe get rid of them nice and quick. And so again here, guys, this is my strategy. Now you could come to the left here. You could try it out. You could try whatever works best for you guys, but I'm just showing you guys what works best for me. And this is just simply like the setup I've given you guys here is just simply until round 25 and then an X fill. This is just simple for camos and XP. You know what I mean? 25 rounds, X fill. That's all you're going to need. It's just anything after a 25th round, guys, it just takes too long to gain XP and camos and stuff like that. So not even worth it. Get yourself the round 25 and then X fill. Unless you want to go for high rounds and then you would go ahead and maybe pack a punch three times. You know, get all your perks, all the good stuff and then come up here if you're going for high rounds. But this is my strat, guys. This is how I like to do it. So I wait for all the zombies to pile up. I peek my head up, guys. I shoot. 
Because, like, once you're waiting for all your zombies to pile up, it's going to give you time for your shatter blasts to get ready. And then I just stick my head up, shoot one time. It's going to blast all the zombies, and then I crouch again. And that's it, guys. It's as easy as that. Try it out. Let me know how this glitch goes down in the comments below. Don't forget to smash that like button and keep my algorithm real. Subscribe to that bell notification on so you don't miss any of my awesome, excellent videos. Guys, get in the game. Glitch something out. Have some fun. Until next time, I'm the Puff Man. Peace out.